Hey folks, welcome back to another video on the Living in Halifax channel. I'm Tom Moore, your host. Today, we are going over what a home inspection is. I'm out here with Ryan Berry and Pillar to Post, and we're going to be checking out this house. So this is a video kind of for, for buyers that are unfamiliar with the home inspection process, what to expect, what it's for, and we're at a beautiful house on a beautiful day. So uh, without further ado, let's get to it. Okay, so I'm here with Ryan Berry with Pillar to Post. There's the info right there, lovely. Ryan's kind of my go-to guy for inspection. So what can we, we're out here in Fall River today. We're obviously doing a new build, which is a little unique, yep. but what what are we kind of, what are we looking for? What's your role in this, in this process when we're doing the home inspections? Well, ultimately when we're looking at houses, whether they be new construction or even older construction, we're looking for deficiencies. And ultimately I'm looking for the big ticket items, something that's gonna cost a lot of money upfront yeah. um, or safety issues. We always include little things in the report, but that's mostly for the home owner. Okay, cool, awesome. So we're gonna be kind of looking around the outside to start. Ryan's gonna pop the drone up here, take a look at the roof because he, neither one of us can see on top of the roof from down here. Then we're gonna head inside and uh, check out what's going on in there. Okay. So we found kind of one thing that people often will bring up is is foundation. So we found, uh, you know, uh, some, why don't you explain? Right? I mean, ultimately, when I, I, I do the exterior of the house, I spend a great deal of time looking at the structural components, which, of course, is your foundation. If you look over here, we do have a small crack here. This is known as a hairline crack. There is no deflection. So if I run my finger there, it's not scraping against. It hasn't. The, the foundation have doesn't move this way. So this is not really a crack to really worry about. Yeah. Uh, this is just a settling crack, but it is something to kind of keep an eye on over the years. Okay, cool. So now we're kind of in the backyard, walking around the back of the house. And Ryan, what, what do we see here? So uh, what I'm seeing here from this contractor is ideal. This is exactly what I want to see. A lot of the older houses I inspect, we don't see these, but in new construction, I would expect to see these. So in between your joist hangers, you see these bolts. These are known as leg bolts. They actually drive right into the, the house and connect to a header board, and that holds your deck to the house. And then your joists, which run out the length of the deck, which hold your floorboards, they're also connected by way of uh, joist hangers. Yeah. which is what you want so then the deck doesn't pull away from the house. Okay, perfect. Good, good news. Okay, so usually when we're doing showings, uh, the agents are doing showings with the buyers, we're not necessarily going into the attic. Sometimes, depending on the house, we will, but obviously this is a pretty integral part of the home inspection. So what are we looking for when, when you're going up there? So the most important thing is that uh, there's no compromised sheathing or or rafters or trusses, depending on what's up there. Um, proper ventilation. So does the house have gable vents? Does it have a rich vent? Are the soffits being um, blocked by the insulation? You want them actually held back by baffles. So that's all stuff I'm gonna check out when I'm up there. Okay, cool, perfect. Ryan, so what are we looking at here in terms of this little uh, is a heat gun? Yeah, so this is an infrared gun, and what we use this for is I actually go around the house to turn on the heat and make sure that heat is coming out at all the registers. Now here, we don't have registers, we actually have in-floor forced air coming out of a furnace, mm -hmm. but it saves me time for running around and touching every one of these and making sure they're, they're heating up. All I have to do is run around the house and point this in the general direction. Right. As you can see. Cool. Very cool. Okay, so we're winding, I guess, up this this inspection. What are we doing now here, Ryan? So, um, LA Post launched during COVID uh, the virtual tour, so people that can't be on site, like, which is today, uh, one of our clients have gone on site. 
Uh, we do a virtual tour so they can actually walk through the house after reading the report and then they can actually send us to friends and family as well. Okay, cool. Awesome. So a little virtual tour built right in.